okay, I'm making this video because Valor's bulbs, it's been really, really wet here. And uh, Valor's bulbs and cartilages have really released out the back. And I'm starting to see, and I, I thought this was the way it was, but the periopal skin and the bulb, how wide is it supposed to be? Um, it's not supposed to be any wider than the coronary band ring. Uh, because that's where the bulbs are supposed to be and so what's going on here in his feet is that uh, the the bulb skin and periopal gets pulled underneath and so the horse is actually walking on the back of the periopal instead of on the frog where it's supposed to be and the frog corium and all is pushed forward but as the frog stay comes back into the foot Everything starts shifting and it starts pulling that frog and the anatomy and, and the bulbs and everything back up and back behind the foot. And so, oh, just a minute here. Got to get my stand. Okay. Give it here. I kind of wish I'd have taken more, more picture here. Okay, so what you're seeing here, I want you to see how that has come loose right here. Um, at first I thought the heel was being pulled, pushed forward, but it wasn't. The bulbs are coming loose. Now you can see the periopal skin is clear up here. See the frog, the true frog is right here. This frog that's right here is actually supposed to be back here. And this is what is gradually happening. See. See, you'll find that your whole frog moves back like this. And this frog here, this is supposed to be right here. Right here. And so this is what is happening. The bulbs have released right here. Look at that weird. I was like, what is that, you know? And what that is is where the, the bulbs have come back up here. And it's, it's gone. See this? See that? Right there? That used to be connected right there. <laughs> guys this is so awesome okay this is this is a trip wow see now it's been super wet here and this has helped this area right here release and these bulbs come back look at that see it right 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 in here that was connected right there and right there and it has come apart like this and the bulbs have come back up here how amazing now what will happen is okay this frog stay is getting humongous here. Wow. You know, I'm pushing the digital cushion all up where it's back where it's supposed to be. It's amazing. Let's go like this now. Now this part is actually underneath the foot on the bottom of the foot where the bulbs were right there. Okay? But now the bulbs, instead of being pulled down here, like so, okay, now the bulbs have pulled back up like this, and they're right. Oh, come on, quick, quick. Hold on. And they're right here, on the back of the foot where they're supposed to be, up off the ground. This is just stupendous. And the frog, super healthy, super healthy. And what a blessing, what a blessing this whole is, this is to see this right here, this amazing thing that's going on right here. All right. I'm, I'm totally amazed. I saw that and I went, what is that? What is that? See how it's different here? See how this bulb skin is? Okay, again, what was going on? This bulb skin right here was attached down here. And in the rain and everything, and because the frog stay is pushing it up right there, okay, it finally pushed the bulbs up where they're supposed to be. Well, this is wonderfully exciting. Now, I don't know if it's happened on the rest of the feet. Um, let's, let's go see what's going on. Let's go see. We know now what to expect. 
let's see if it's happened with this foot. Okay, um, it's, it hasn't quite happened uh, with this foot as much, but some. Okay, this from here to here is stretched, but the frog has not come back the way it's supposed to. Okay, but these are up here. Okay, this frog stay isn't quite as big. This take that. Okay, hmm. See, I'm gonna have to study this. Not quite the same here. This foot isn't quite as good as the other foot in doing it. Um something going on. I think that this frog is being maybe held forward and I need to find the true apex where it's removed again so that it can come back because this one is right here. The end of the frog on this this foot is right here and uh, not sure what what this is but yeah it's still come on down look there you can see the ledge there. See, this was down here attached to the heels, and now it's come up. So, yes, it has done uh, similar or same. It just looks a little bit different. Awesome. Yeah, it's the same. Okay, well that's pretty cool. Well, uh, I wanted to. Now, what I should have showed you, I can't remember, so excited, um, was if I showed you a side shot of this foot. Okay, there you go. Now, you see this? How the bulb was released out the back? Now, the capsule and the bulb and everything was originally tucked under there. Okay? And uh, you can also see in the cartilage how it's more straight, like this, instead of curved. Okay. Look at that. Look at that frog stay. See? You can feel it clear up here. Look at that. See how the frog goes down? Like that. When the pastern here descends down and hits that. There, that's what happens. See there? Pretty cool. Yahoo. What's this? Give you a that foot. This crack is finally closing up. There we go. junk on my porch. All right. Well, there you go. Again, it's freaking amazing. Look at the frog stay. Look at the big foot. Okay, so now that shows you how much just and this horse he's already had his bulbs released a lot but look at how much they released and came up and look at the width of the periopal skin your bulbs skin is not supposed to be any wider than that and when this is all said and done this part of this frog right here will be clear back here back here all right hallelujah <laughs>